graph, as you can tell, is the perfect example of exponential growth. Here we have the data, the real data, of the coronavirus cases in Italy, February and March, day by day. So at the beginning, we just had a few cases, and they were not really even growing for days. Then suddenly, we can see how they started growing, which is hard to see. And day by day, they started growing even faster and faster and faster. Until we see at the very end, in March 23rd, that there was a lot of cases. There's a lot of cases of this virus. This is a perfect example of exp exponential growth because viruses not only grow but actually spread in exponential way. Exponential growth is when our data is not only low numbers but what we notice is that it's barely moving or not moving at all. But suddenly as we go on every step we notice that this our data our numbers are increasing and every time that it increases at every step, the increase is higher and higher to the point that it's starting to grow very rapidly until we end up with very high numbers. This curve is what we call the exponential growth. Here we have a perfect example for exponential decay. This example shows the depreciation or the value of a new car. So we can see at the beginning how a car is valued at a very high price when it's new. But as every single year goes by, the value of that car decreases. Now, one of the things that we have about exponential decay is that it will be decreasing in value very rapidly at the beginning, but then as the years go by, it'll still decrease its value, but very slowly. This is what we call, this is the perfect example for exponential decay. Exponential decay is exactly the opposite. What does that mean? We start with a very high amount of very large numbers. And every step of the way, it's like we are starting to decrease, but we are decreasing very rapidly. The difference is that every step of the way, it seems like our decrease gets smaller and smaller and smaller until it seems like it's not decreasing at all. And it's almost flat. This is what we call the exponential decay. Mm -hmm.